Out in the good stuff today. More good powder. Boy, these wheelers have been having fun. There are ruts everywhere up here. Yesterday was officially the first day the wheelers could come out here, but they've been coming out here for weeks now. Actually, they uh, pretty much year-round will sneak out. They like to do it at night, which I'm fine. They're cool. Pretty awesome to be able to drive a four-wheel drive vehicle across snow this deep. But as of April 1, they officially can go anywhere they want, and then they really line up. Like the last day of March, they um, come out like at 11.59, spool up their vehicles, and right at midnight, they go crazy. Because it's game on, they have a certain season, maybe about a month, that they can legally just let the air out of their tires and dri drive anywhere they want. They got some sleet coming down. Ah, I gotta smell the two-stroke following the snowmobiles. It's not a great smell. You know, after a day of following snowmobilers, my everything, my clothes, you bring it inside, everything just smells of the two smokers. I have no idea what's going on up there. For some reason they departed from the trail. Oh, it's just a momentary error threw him off the trail. Now, one thing I need to do, I'm gonna switch gears. I need to be in second more often, and a lot of times I'm right between first and second. So I need to order those up, order that up new gear in the back. Not sure where we're at. Well, it's just in and out of visibility. See better in the trees here. That's one of the things with snow biking. When you get in the trees during low visibility, it helps a lot. You can see much better than out in those open slopes with the flat light. All right, I'm kind of following my buddy here, kind of off his shoulder. He knows where he's going. Normally it's not great to cruise around underneath cornices, but this cornice is not above a slope so even if it it's a wind load but it's not taking us anywhere if something happens look at that big boy big mushroom top
Oh, you can almost see down in there. I think I can shoot over the top here. See what I can do. Oh, <laughs> that was maybe not a good idea. I don't want to drop off that. Huh. Think. Okay, I am about to embark on an interesting mission up through the trees. all so deep. get more the other direction ah missed that turn Pull my bike around. Okay, the boys over there are getting turned back by some trees. Since I'm out here solo, I didn't like how steep this was getting, so I tried to turn out and my bike stalled. And you need to be able to throttle to make that turn, so I just plopped over. All right, it's time to get going again. I think I'm at the point where I'm about to bust over the hump here. <laughs> Snow is so deep in here. Okay, let's see. <laughs> I'm almost up top. Almost. Well, that's a big tree well. Hey, I'm almost making, I just can't find myself a shot to get up. Come on. Well, I am almost, almost up there. I just can't. 
There it is. Ah, oh. thought I had it. I am there. Maybe I should have kept, I don't know. Kind of some wild. All right, I think I'm gonna... Okay, we made it up to the cabin. Doesn't look like much of a cabin right now. The snowpack's so high. That's the outhouse. It is closed due to COVID-19. So we can't go in. Wheelers have been having some fun up here. It is. The ruts are really deep. They came across some deep snowpack. Okay, those guys were heading out that way. Whoa. There are some big big drifts in here. Oh, there's some more. Get through these 